Hello, I'm going to show you how to create an AI bot NPC using a behavior tree with site perception. In part one, I created an AI bot character, an AI bot controller, an AI bot behavior tree, an AI bot blackboard, and an AI bot task. In part two, I created an AI bot service. And these are all going to be used in part three. Right click the blackboard and edit. Add a new key, type bull. I'm going to name it player sighted and save. Right click the AI bot character, edit, add component, AI perception, under AI perception add element, in the drop down select AI site config. Expand this sense under detection by affiliation. Check detect neutrals. Right click AI perception, add event, add on target perception update. Drag off the exec pin. Search for cast a third person character. Connect the actor to the object. Drag off the exec pin. Search for set value as bool. Uncheck context sensitivity. Right click, search for Get Blackboard, connect to Target, right click, search for Make Literal Name, connect return value to key name, enter value, player, cited. Drag out the stimulus and check context sensitive and break AI stimulus. Expand this and connect the sense to the bull value and compile and save. Right click behavior tree, edit, from the root add a selector, from the selector add a sequence, connect this to the other sequence. Drag off of here and add AI bot get ran loop task. Add task move to add another task. Wait.
add a decorated blackboard. Add a decorated blackboard here. On this blackboard, set the it to is not set and player sided. On this one, set it to is set and player sided. On this task, set it to location. This one set to location. And save. I already entered an AI bot character into the scene. So now I'm going to press play to test. You can press the single quote to turn on debug and four for perception. On the right hand side you'll see player's side and variable is false. When that turns true that means I'm in sight. Now he sighted me. He'll come to me. Okay, so now I'm going to move away from him and stay in sight and he'll follow me. Now I'm going to move to the back of him and then player sighted will turn false. He'll lose sight of me and start searching for me again. So now player sighted is false. He's searching for me. You can see he has kind of a hard time finding me again. Next I'm going to show how to adjust the behavior tree so that he'll be able to find me faster. Now he's sighted me again, he'll come to me. Right click the behavior tree, edit, click on the declarator, change observer aborts to both. The same thing for this declarator, both. What this does is it allows you to report the condition. For example, if player sighted is not set, it's in this condition, and then the player becomes sighted, it can abort and go to this condition. This will enable your AI bot to be able to find you faster. Save this and close. I'm going to play the program with the behavior tree showing. So I'm going to show that you can find me faster now I'm going to run to the back of the seal. Okay, he already found me. I'll try again. Okay, now he's searching for me. And he found me. Okay, now he's searching for me. Yeah.